We now move on to the champion versus champion match. Kid Blood, the heavyweight champion, going against hardcore champion GOAT. Now, obviously, this is not a belt match. Both people keep their belt, win, lose, or draw. This is purely about honor. And this match was specifically, weeks ago, requested by GOAT, who lost against Kid Blood once and wanted a cage match against him. And yes, this is before either one of them had a belt, am I correct? That's true. Neither of them had belts at the time. And now, ironically, bo they both have the two top belts. I know, ain't this a great story? I mean, you couldn't script a better line than that, but you know, some people don't like the YTWF and they can suck it. <laughs> well, that belt looks great on Kid Blood. Who has been shooting nice promos. Oh, just his like promos are beautiful. Yeah, and, and, and just like Craig, they stepped it up. They did their training. They did their homework. They've been doing all the all the things they know to, and they need to get to the best shot and have some of these great matches like this. And Craig, greatest of all time, GOAT, will be wanting to win this one just to even, even it up. Yeah, I, I got to say, the, oh, the deck was stacked it. against wait him, but it. he's done did great. It's coming. Yes. Wait for it. It's coming. Yeah. They, they, everybody can sense it coming. I see. I'm ready for it this time. Greatest. Greatest of all time. Proud of me? Yes. Yes, yes. I was ready long ago. That hardcore belt, although not as shiny and pretty, represents the second most prestigious, and just barely second most prestigious honor. Yeah. Yes, and that's just because it's the new belt, you know. Oh, there Greatest is of all, all time. time. Twice. Bam. Just to let you know, just to remind you. And the cage is now around them. They can escape the cage. They can pin in the cage. They can use the cage as a weapon. And let's see. Oh, Craig goes for the gold. Can oh, wow. No, he pushed him right up against the cage. Looking good in those pajama bottoms and whoops! Poke. Poked him right in the eye. Right in the eye. Oh, and right in the back. Ooh. Well, he wants to, you know, stab him in the back whenever he can't see. He's taking advantage of that blind spot. Now, Goat has a slight advantage because it's more hardcore than anything else. Oh, and yeah. Yeah, in that aspect, you know, he's not going to get in trouble for cheating, for hitting the ref, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Little mistakes like that ain't going to go against him. But he can't go out and get a weapon. He has to use it as a weapon. That's right. And they can't. it's not like a Hell in Cell where they can go outside. It's you stay in and you escape to win, or you actually pin them or submit them in the ring. Well, is this one of the ones where uh, you can go out the door and uh, get the lock taken off the door? Or is no, this one you, where you... If you escape the door, and I don't know if they're using the door. I think it's only over the cage. I don't know if they're allowing... For yeah, them. I know that they can lock the door sometimes, and I don't know if they have this stipulation where the door is locked. Well, the door is locked. They won't be able to go out the door. All right, then it's pure. They win. But they can yeah, pin, too. Yeah, I don't really like it when the door, you have that option of crawling out the door. I think that's the point of a cage going straight over the top, and he went down low. And Craig getting his bearings, and oh, missed. Oh, my. <clears throat> Craig the upper hand, and oh, getting that arm. Somebody get some oil for you, that crow's chair, please. Oh, yeah, my old squeaky chair. I love it. Oh, and he's giving him a strangle wraparound hold there. <laughs> nice one. I know. Oh, no turnbuckle there. Using it as a weapon. Kid Blood has to start fighting back, and oh, there you go. What's going on there? Oh, oh. oh, that's a great spin in DDT there. I had no idea who was going to win that one. Oh, now he's mocking him. Sarcastically begging for forgiveness. 
Oh, and rolling thunder. Yeah, and just, just to do that, just to add a little bit more. Disgrace. Oh, keeps him down. So he likes to hit him when his back's turned. Now he's going for that move again, the strangle wraparound. Craig's been doing really good about focusing on the back and blind attacks against Kid Blood. Well, he's actually recently made a video to McFucker. Uh-oh! Oh, he's going up! He's going up. Uh-oh, he's trying to find a foothold. And no! Oh! Now Kid Blood. Uh-oh. And, oh, there we go. Wow. But uh, Goat made a video to McFucker telling him that he has a he wants his hat. He wants his Australian hat. Yeah, I've noticed that little war they got going on. Quite amusing. Gotta love it when he takes on the hardcore people and oh Craig is flat on his back and Whoa Oh wow. Whoa Oh, that's a perfect way to follow up a low blow like that. Well, it like I said, just like hardcore. But, oh, both of them are just feeling worse for the wear at this point. Look at them. Just so, oh, wow. Craig is, oh, right in that non-protected corner again. Oh, look at him. Oh, oh that is bad. Oh, right off the ropes. He's just looking wow, at Wow, look at him. Oh. Greatest of all time. He just threw that in there. If this was for the... Gold, I wonder if Kid Blood be putting up more of a fight. Ooh. Right now, this is, you know, as a champ, you got to think about your next match. You know, how well is he going to be? You know, Kid Blood is going to want to get out of here with, with, with health on his side. And if he loses too much in this match, the next person can win, can win it from him. So, you know, is he really going to worry about winning or is he going to worry about taking less damage right. now, I'm not sure if they're in the rumble that follows this match oh yeah if they're in the rumble man they're not going to have a lot left honestly they yeah. shouldn't but they'd like a shot anyway well yeah like everyone else that's just the way it goes a lot of people uh, does double duty and King Jin Delby would like to defend his belt <laughs> or his crown right you seen that oh oh wow Oh, he's just right. wrecking him. Kid Blood needs to get some type of defense going right now because for a little while things have been going in the in the favor of Goat. Well, maybe Hydroponic was a lucky one, and I think Kid Blood always had some help, either from his manager or from McFucker. And uh oh, he's scary. Oh, look at Goat going up, and Kid Blood's down. This ain't good. Kid Blood, better get up soon. Yeah, if he don't get up now, this oh, it's there's no way. I, 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 I it's too late. It's too late. That's okay. it. Winner, hardcore champion, first undisputed champion of the YTWF, right there. Well, remember it was not title for title. It was just champion. Yeah, but under, you know what I'm saying. Just there, there's no doubt about it that he's the champ. Well, he definitely showed that he's the champ within these confines. But in a regular setting, you may never know. Well, honestly, but he has the bragging rights. For tonight, Go can say, The champ is here! Yes, it is two to one, though. Tech